Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some Mirror's Edge. Last time we completed Chapter 6, we discovered what Pirandello Kruger, the security company, have been up to. Uh, and we d d the, and we spotted Pope's killer on a boat down at the docks. And we're gonna go get him. So let's uh, press the wrong section. We're gonna continue game. And start Chapter 7. Just charging in there recklessly, kiddo. That's Pope's killer, Mark. Yeah, well, there might be more heat out there. It's too risky to try to get to the boat by foot. You'll be spotted for sure. There must be some way to slip in undercover. Yeah, we gotta get onto the boat, but we cannot just walk onto it. We need to sneak in. And head over this way. Like it's time for a little stowaway action, Faith. Quick, before it goes. Yeah, we want to stow away on one of the delivery trucks that's headed to the boat. Uh... Just make our way over there. Uh, before we actually pick it up, we just want to have a quick look around. Because I believe there is a bag hanging out here on the ground floor. Well, I'm not quite sure where. <laughs> I know it's here somewhere. There we go. Bag one. We are going to get all 30. Um, as you can see, we're getting quite close. But this is a short game. Now then, let's get moving. I'm just going to hide in this truck for a little while. There we go. What the hell is in this boat anyway? No idea. Could be munitions, I guess. Might be to do with this Project Icarus. Look, head straight for the deck if that's where you saw this guy. Once you found your killer, get some answers and get out fast. Lots of blue traffic in the area, so get ready for a fight. Truck's now in motion. Trial of King Connors is likely to take place in the next few hours. As usual, City Eye Channel News will be first on the scene. I'm not sure why there aren't subtitles for this, like, miscellaneous dialogue. I guess it's not super important. By the way, I can't jump or crouch right now, or punch, or really anything. I can just sort of walk around. I think the main point of this scene is to let you look at Faith's shadow in the elevator. What, like in an elevator? There you go. Check out our cool hair. <laughs> He's very pretty. Okay, we're arriving now. Okay, we can crouch and jump again. And punch. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of guards around. Okay, I didn't do that right. <laughs> okay, yeah, you just sort of push the door open by walking into it. Like that. That guy has a machine gun. <laughs> oh, let's try to get a bit closer. This is like a shotgun or something. There we go. 
Yeah, that looks like a machine gun, all right. Okay. You're obviously supposed to, you know, sneak around a bit more and run past them and stuff, but picking up their guns also works. Okay. Now we want to go up this pipe. Yeah, they're going to keep shooting at us, so uh, let's try to get up high. Okay. As you can see, there's another, there's another runner symbol, so there will be a bag around here somewhere. Yes, yes, I am up here somewhere. Please do not shoot at me. Here it is. Are the trackers organizing? Anyone? <laughs> yeah, that's two. Okay. Uh. Alright, let's try this again. Okay, doing good, doing good. So we are now actually on the boat, uh, by the way. To be clear. Uh, I think? Actually, I can't remember. We may just be, like, near the boat. I don't remember if we're on it yet. But we are a lot closer to it than we were before. <laughs> um, so let's just keep going and see. Where we actually are. We're in a garage, obviously, but I don't know where that garage is. It's possible it's on the boat, it's possible it's not. Okay. Alright, here we go. Okay, go this way. I think that's most of the, the blues we've got to outrun for the time being. Go. And for a little bit of squeezing. Get on the pole, Faith. There we go. We <laughs> have a shimmy here. You can check out our cool air in the shadows there if you want. Pretty adorable. For some reason we can't climb on top of this one. I guess there's just not enough room up there. But you think Faith could crouch or something, but I guess not. Gotta keep shimmying like this. Okay, we went a bit further than we were supposed to. <laughs> you actually have to look this way while you're shimmering. Sh sh shimmying. If you turn around, it won't let you shimmy. And up. And... And... Up. Okay. Says he's got a runner in your area. Says they reported a lot of activity on that boat. 
but he seems what he thinks is your guy on the top deck. Yep, we're going for the top deck. And yeah, I think we are actually on the boat. We're not just like in the docks or whatever. I could not remember. Uh What to do here? Um, okay, let's see. Be a little bit of a thingy there I had to get enough height to come to this piece. Then we go around the corner here. Just jump to this piece. Then what? I could try to climb up into that, but it looks pretty high. Oh no, that works. Alright. Okay, we're doing good, we're doing good. Ooh, that looks unpleasant. Um, let's see here. I can't really remember this part of the game very well, to be honest. Uh, get up there, right? Yeah, easy peasy. Oh, we actually want to go through there. Okay. on how you do it. Um, hmm. I don't remember how this works. Uh, get up here, get up here. I don't think getting onto that piece helps you. I think you're aiming to get onto that thing. Um, ow. Oops. Well, I fell down. So I gotta redo a little bit here. Uh, Jump. Okay, did the jump wrong. Shimmy our way around here again. Shimmy our way along here next. In fact, let's just jump up there. Let's just jump up there. We can climb, and now we're up here again. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah, um, I love this game, but there are certain parts of it that are just a little jankier than they, they really ought to be. <laughs> um, yeah. Oops. Definitely, like, the parts where you're running around real fast on rooftops are better than the parts where you're, you know, awkwardly uh, crawling around inside the building trying to climb up stuff. Um, so more of a focus on the rooftop running would have made the game probably a bit stronger. Okay, okay, uh, let me see here. Can I grab that? No. Too low to actually just jump up and grab that. Um, what do I do here? I do not remember. Let me do is this level here. If I get on this ledge, does that help me at all? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. Ah. Let's just spawn me up here again instead of making me do all of that one more time. I have a feeling it's got something to do with running along there. Uh, that's 
Almost. Because if I can grab that ledge, I can get, get up from there without any trouble. Um, doesn't seem like I can do that, though. Thing that I hmm. Doesn't look like it. <laughs> there we go. I'm still not sure if that's the correct thing to do, but it worked. Now we can get into the, into the vent like we were trying to. Okay. Whew. Onward. Okay, we're getting to the deck now. Did we go down here? Oh, a little bit, but not much. Way through to the top deck above you. Near Cardex 6. Cardex 6? Yep. You can't open any of the doors that don't go where you want to go, even though they look identical to the ones that do go where you want to go. It's a, it's a little bit janky. Like, you should be able to turn that wheel, but you, you can't. Authorised personnel only? Well, that's for me for sure. I'm so authorised. We are now on the top deck. And there are snipers up here! Let's watch out for the snipers! Stay in cover, work your way towards them. Time to get some answers. I believe the third bag is around here somewhere? Yep, there it is. The bright yellow object that's glowing for no reason. There we go. Okay. Let's go find out what's going on with this murder. Yeah, we, we can get sniped and not die, thankfully, so... We can make careful use of cover. Oh. Okay, let's try that one more time. Gotta open this door again first, which is a bit annoying, but mm, no big deal. Look at all the explosive barrels here. That's why I'm taking so much damage. Again, like, instead of just, like, running real fast, you got to sort of sneak from cover to cover here. Um, I think a lot, yeah, a lot of the level design in this game doesn't work super well with the way the gameplay is designed. Which is interesting.
Okay. Going up. Yeah, yeah, this combatant is, like, like, probably the most competent fighter in the game, and it's a bit of a problem. We don't counter anything you do. to do is try to take their gum, but I forget how you do that. Because they're not glowing, doing the red glowing thing. And yeah, they counter your attack. Let's keep going. I think I have to actually make them do something first. I get what though? Oh, there we go. Okay. He's getting away. Now we gotta get chasing. Okay. So yeah, I think the earlier parts of the game are generally pretty a lot stronger in terms of like design and gameplay. Um, this one you can see a lot of the um, the cracks in the formula, I guess. Okay, the chase sequence went fine, because that's what the game is good at. The combat, not so much. Well, that's weird. It's showing us like a black shadow for some reason? Is that like a glitch? It weren't looking like that before. You're supposed to not take him head on. Like, there's red things around that I can't do anything with for some reason. Well, maybe it doesn't look like it. You're supposed to get over there and fight him.
Ready to find out who it is? Tried to warn you off. I'm sorry. You've got to learn to let go, Faith. You remember? Best. What you did with your family. The runners are screwed. Icarus is just the start. And I want to live, Faith, not just survive. Why Pope? His campaign was getting unexpected support, but he got stupid. Started making threats to the wrong people. High up people. He found out about Icarus. So they had you kill him. Him or me. Sorry about Kate. Didn't know she was your sis. Don't ask, Merc. Okay? Heard all I need to hear, kiddo. Listen, Krieg says Kate's just been tried. Already? Wonders of the Swift Justice Program, huh? They found her guilty, Faith. Of course they did. Convoy's taken her off to jail in less than an hour. Drake's organizing a rifle drop near the new CCC building. I'll keep you posted. Get going. And that's it for this video. Next time... We save Kate. We try to. See how we go. I actually can't remember. This chapter, this chapter is called Kate though, so she's definitely involved. <laughs> but yeah, Zell was the one who killed <gasps> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye! <laughs>